the party that is in power in the White House right now is weaponizing the security state and federal agencies against political opponents and those of us who dare to challenge them, those who dare to speak truth and common sense in the face of their insane radical agenda. The strength of our democracy relies on our trust, we the people's trust in the rule of law, and by weaponizing these public institutions for their own benefit, democratic leaders are undermining the rule of law and turning our democracy into a banana republic. Now the, exip, the, the list of examples of how they're doing this is too long. We don't have enough time to go through them today, but just to name a few, you remember Obama using the IRS to target conservative organizations. We have Biden's Department of Justice arresting peaceful pro-life protesters and sending them to prison. He's labeled supporters of President Trump as the most extremist group in our country and a threat to our democracy. They created the Domestic Terror Unit, the Department of Homeland Security, to go after parents for having the audacity to show up at their Board of Education and say, we don't want you teaching our kids about sexuality. We don't want you taking them to drag shows. We don't want you bringing sex toys to second graders in school. Of course, we had Chuck Schumer directly threatening Supreme Court justices with consequences if they dared to overturn Roe v. Wade. When the party in power doesn't believe in the rule of law, but they're the ones responsible for not only writing, but enforcing those laws, our democracy is doomed. 